On the brand new season of Behind the Story. It's just my story. Hey, hello. Ah, you can't tell me I'm not black enough because of the way I sound. Um, I don't like labels, and I went to school for this. I sit for eight months without work, and then you say, open up the industry. Open up the industry for what? I have never been so livid in my whole life. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome. But this is not behind the story. This is something to excite you and entice you for when behind the story comes out. We have a very special guest, and this special guest next will be the incredible, award-winning, killing the game crossover actress in the country, a queen, a goddess. Everybody's kind of favorite actress. She's a lady you don't know enough about, and that's why I brought her onto the show. But before we deliver the show to you, I'm going to ask her some quick five questions and see how she is able to handle that so you know what's coming up really soon. All right, Susan Tati, how are you doing? Oh, Pearl, I'm so good. I'm so good. Thanks for having you me. You look so beautiful. It's a pleasure and an honor to have you. What do you mean? Thank you. Thank you, Pearl. <laughs> look, she's also calm. She's going to come out. Don't worry. <laughs> She's going to come out. Okay, so to excite everybody for uh, what we have in store for them when the show comes out, I'm going to ask you a couple of uh, quick fire questions. Are you ready? Okay, go easy, go easy. Good. So one must die. Ne? Uh, one must go die first. The pandemic or patriarchy? That is the trickiest question ever because <laughs> both of them must go. <laughs> well, which one must go first? So in, in the South African context, the patriarchy. Okay. Globally, the pandemic, of course. Okay, I, I'll take that. I, I was going to push you further, mm -hmm. but it's fine. <laughs> One must die, gospel music or jazz? Well, these are not fair questions. <laughs> <at all>. um, <laughs> uh, <laughs> gospel, it lifts the soul. Jazz lifts the soul. Can both of them survive? Is that a One answer? of them has to die. Please. You have to choose No, that. Pearl, that's not fair. Just one. Mm, uh, Apple, no. Ah, <laughs> next no, question, next question, die. next question. No, 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 one must die. No, no, no. One gospel music lift, uplifts the soul, <laughs> jazz soothes the soul. Uh, no, because if I answer gospel, then, then um, no, Pearl, no. Move on, move on. Okay, okay. Um, gospel jazz. <laughs> ah, Sika, you see now. Mm -mm. One must die first. Racism or sexism? Gosh, gosh, these are really tricky questions. Both, both are wrong. Um, and once again, in context, racism, South Africa, America, all the countries that have racism and sexism, sexism must just die, full stop. Sexism has to die. You know, for me, we know racism, we can overcome it because we've done it before. Sexism, no country in the world has been able to achieve gender equality. Oh, well, Paul, I don't know about racism being overcome because we're still experiencing it in bucket loads. So we, racism is a state true. of mind, you see. So it's people's attitudes, it's people's... But there's progress. I guess then also there's sexism, there's progress. Mm, I don't know about... Uh, uh, we wouldn't be having um, hashtags blacks, Black Lives Matter if racism had but been now, dealt with. But, but, but now we can actually fight and like... We're just naming and shaming, that's the only difference. Uh, are, are we yeah, naming and shaming with sexism? Yes, we are as well. So, yeah. which one must die? Let them die completely, both of them. Let's they, obliterate they them. To die. <laughs> yeah, I, I didn't even make these questions, I just have to ask them. I, the questions I actually made you hear about on the show. Uh, one more. One must die, this will be easy for you. One must die, Facebook or Instagram? Ah! <laughs> <laughs> Apple, you're very unfair. So Facebook for me and my age group is the best thing ever. Instagram for the followers and uh, the, the people who watch the shows. So can they both survive, please? Can none of them no, die? No, but, but, but we were discussing realities behind the scenes. And the rea what's the reality of Facebook for people in your age group? Which I think is unfair, but I hear what yeah, you're saying. No, so, so I've kept in touch with all my school friends who are all over the world through Facebook. And uh, I realized... I I really, I need Facebook more than Instagram. Instagram is for, m more for work. So if I had to say my private life, Facebook is great. For the other life, the professional life, Instagram is great. I'll definitely take that. Okay. And you find a lot of my age groups are not on Instagram. Unless they're in the industry. But a lot of my, I, I have a lot of friends who are not in the industry. Most of my friends are not in the industry. So uh, Facebook becomes a way we keep in touch. We see 
when our kids' birthdays are and all the milestones in their lives, because they're not on Instagram. So I would, I would completely miss out if I was only on Instagram. So I need okay. Facebook more. Okay, so Instagram is that. Anyway. Ah, happen, happen, I didn't say that. <laughs> Thank you so much.